Hello everyone and welcome back to Mag Mammal Free. So, continuing on from where we left off, we are back in the mausoleum. Wait, no, that's the name of the arena. Where we really are is in the Pagoda? Arena Pagoda, yes. Taking on the foes of antiquity. So, in the previous video, we took on the. Uh, Fortress Boss Rush, yes. Um, so today I'm going to be taking on Aquamans. Alas, matey, there you challenge the Masters Mausoleum Arena. Take on 28 Robo Masters from Dr. Wily's previous attempts at taking over the world. Who? What are you? You're ha ha, you're funny, mate. How could you forget the revolt I was a part of? Just wait till Blade Man, Torch Man, Oil Man, and Shark Man hear of this lark. So. This is actually my second recording attempt at this arena. The first attempt failed in a rather drastic manner, which I'm going to show you at the end. So, yeah. We actually do have an outtake, believe it or not. Um, so I've actually talked to this guy. He says exactly the same things. Again, if we leave this and this, we get boss, I assume. So... For now, let's just begin the Robot Master Arena. I've always been a sucker of this, for these kind of things, so... Yeah, just fighting a flurry of bosses in a row, always something I've enjoyed. So, oh! I did do perfect runs up to Mega Man 4, and then I did ro um, some... Uh, fan made games as well, so I never did make it to Mega Man 5. But I fought Gyroman enough times to understand how your battle goes. Will I ever return to perfect running? I don't know. But, I mean, I love so. I love Mega Man. It is in my top 3 favourite gaming franchise, so. Uh. I didn't have enough clearance for him there. I do enjoy Commando Man's fire. I didn't really know where to go there though. Fuck. I mean, I did say I enjoy your fight, but that doesn't mean you're meant to kill me. Commando Man, chill, please. Okay, that was a much tighter fight than it should have been. Fake Man actually made me remember what the battle is like. I'm gonna take a life here. So in my previous attempt, my first attempt, I didn't really remember Fake Man's fight, but now I at least have a bit more exposure to his pattern, so hopefully we won't take as much damage. Yes. It's the double shot that I always forgot about. That's what kept getting me. There it is. I see his pattern is pretty much the same. How do you... So if you shoot, you shoot back. I get it. I get it. I get your pattern. Ow, and there's that one shot. So that one flies over your head. I get... Maybe I don't get your pattern. No, I do. That's what I do. Okay, we'll make you jump back. There we go. Okay, I get fake man's pattern. It's always the same. I'm gonna take this because Iceman, if you're not careful, can do a lot of damage, but I mean, it's Iceman. Ow! Especially when you get so claustrophobically close like this. Bye, ice man. Yeah, the bosses don't do too much damage here. Except the one boss that I'm very, very wary of now. The one boss that has an instant death pack mid arena. Yes. I didn't die because I ran out of HP. It was a boss I've never actually fought before. Like, ever. I literally punched Bomb Man in the face there. 
Airman is relatively fine. We have the slide, which makes him easier compared to Mega Man 2, where he threw out impossible patterns. There's actually genuine impossible patterns in Mega Man 2, like this one. I'm not sure that is dodgeable without the slide. Ah, it's the same thing with Iceman. No. Next up, hard man. Well, ironically, you're not very hard. At least not in difficulty. Let's see if the strategy still works from Mega Man. Oh, oh, it doesn't. I am not remembering your battle at all. There's something about doing a big jump and spawning the knuckle off screen. I can kind of like that. Yes, I remember now. Okay, Hardman, space, please! Yeah, so you want to wait until the first one flies off screen, but you can also... Oh, this is not good. Can I have some space, buddy? Please? So Hardman actually did a lot more damage than I thought. Oil man, as long as the entire floor is not full of oil, isn't that bad. Oh yes, I remember now. He's actually invincible in this attack, so make sure to shoot, otherwise he will not jump. That's important. Oh, well, I was a bit early, but worked out. I forgot. Come on, Iron Man, you're just prolonging the fight. I am really not having a good showing here. I am going... Uh... Buster only, naturally, but still, I am not having a good showing here. I mean, if worse comes to worse... I can just basically use energy tank. And that's perfectly okay. So, Woodman is actually... Rather difficult to dodge in Mega Man 2 because you have to run underneath him here. Where I got the timing wrong anyway, but without a slide, yeah, that's quite challenging. Ah! Solar Man, I'm not taking HP. I fought enough Solar Man in this fight, in this game already. And as long as it's not the Temple of Light and Dark Solar Man, then we are more than fine. That's Solar Man. Oh boy. Ah, uh, yeah, you got me. Oh. oh my god, I say that and Solar Man starts kicking my ass. Okay, we really have to focus now, or I'm gonna die otherwise. Don't eat my bullets. Dan Gan Man? I don't think I've fought this boss before. I don't recognize this boss, like, at all. Dan Gan Man? You? I've never fought this boss before. Okay, this is a fully blind battle. Okay, I wasn't sure if you're gonna come back. How do I... Can I like... Wow, I am mad at looking that attack. Wow! I've never fought you either! Hmm. 
Mercury. So the reason I lost my first run was because I was fighting um, a, get a boss from one of the Game Boy games, which I've never fought before. And yeah, they have an instant death attack, so... Can I? You're almost like a shield user in a way, aren't you? I mean, okay, you're relatively fine. Okay, so these are the only attacks you can do. Okay, Mercury's fine. Mercury, perfectly fine. Flashman, I do not fear you. What is the judge doing here? Oh no! Well, that's that's poor. No! Just as your first time. Stone Man, relatively trivial. I'm going for these health power ups much quicker than it feels comfortable, though. Woo! very first flawless battle of the bloody arena, which really doesn't say a lot about me, considering I've played this franchise for so much. The Mario Man is relatively trivial. I've actually fought Yamato Man, it was Gilded Man, which I completely didn't realise was the pattern of. Let's nice try. Sonic Man, we fought enough times in the contest. With Sonic Man, it's better to not go for any like extra shots. Just just follow the pattern. Ow! That is not following the pattern. That's following the pattern, and Sonic Man is perfectly fine. Hornet Man, relatively trivial, but if we can top up a bit of HP, why not? As long as it's not you, Hornet Man, then we are more than fine here. Because you, Hornet Man, oh boy! Is that a thing? Ah! Me! Hornet Man's relatively fine. Here it comes! Ladies and gentlemen, this is the boss. Ahem, <coughs> that has an instant death attack. That ended my run the first attempt. Uranus, you showed off your trick the first time. I will not fall for it the second time. Right, here it comes. Whoa, actually. So when Uranus starts doing this, do not be away. Because that's what happened! Yes. You're in a straight up. Oh, and you're doing the same pattern, okay. Yeah. I only see how this how it works now. I've got to figure it out, buddy. Okay. So yes. 
the very first time, I was far away on the other side of the screen, as you normally would be when you're fighting a boss that you don't know, and Uranus starts doing these hops, which are getting progressively higher, and suddenly I see a huge, huge stone wall coming down, and I realize, oh damn, it's already too late. And that's my story of how I lost the first attempt, yes. It's quite unfortunate, really. Ah! Why did you throw it down? Oh, that was poor. I just went for an extra back shot, which was totally I needed. Nine? You're from DOS as well, aren't you? Yes. I've never fought you. Another boss which I've never fought great. Wait. Woo! It seems it's better to just go with single buster shots for you. I say that. Well, I have e pack I might as well use them. Otherwise I'm gonna die to a boss I've never fought before. Yeah, that would have been there. Personal space, buddy! I get how to fight you, though. Heatman! Well, this is as free as they come. you enough time to know how your battle goes. I got stuck on a platform. That was not really planned. Oh! Yeah. This is a surprisingly clean fight. I didn't ex Ow! I just had to say it, didn't I? Just had to say it. Also, sometimes you jump closer, other times a bit further from the screen. From, from the little platform. Dustman, freebie, moving on. Dustman, Fireman, Fireman, does the same strategy against you work? Let's have a look. Nope. But apparently, this does? Well, okay. Bubble Man. There's instant death spikes. Remember, do not jump into the instant death spikes. I didn't know where to go. I really didn't. I tried to fit into a gap that just was stupidly precise. How do you do you fight Bubble Man? You're not meant to fit through that gap, are you? I'm very confused here. What? That's doable! Right, I keep forgetting that my sprite is actually not as big as it looks. This Rayman is quite tall. So that looked insane. <laughs> Blizzard man. What? Okay. 
Yes, bowling attack. Really, I fired too early. <laughs> Alright, the penultimate boss. Saturn! I'm pretty sure, even though I haven't fought you, I, I, the original you, or, or have I? I did fight a modified Saturn. Yes, 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 I did. So with Saturn, you want to always be in the middle of the screen. We fought a modified Saturn during Bakery Man. So this is fine. So Dynaman was really the only one that made me use an E-Tank because I just never fought them. I got the pattern of his down later. So do we just get some extra? Yeah. Yeah. It's not like I used any of the others, so... Yeah. Oh boy! <coughs> Oops, throat. Let's see what we have. Terra! Would that be right? I feel like I want to keep moving. Yeah. I am so gonna have to use any tank here because otherwise I will have to do the whole arena again and I don't really feel like doing that. I can barely hit you, buddy! Stop, stop teleporting! But I at least understand your pattern though. Doesn't change the fact you're bloody owning this dude. What are you doing now? What are you doing? Is this phase two? Oh boy, that does not look good. What? <laughs> okay, I recognize this attack. Yeah, I have to. Because otherwise, we will die. And this arena over again, so. Triple. Oh my gosh, this boss is cool though. I, I hope that attack is not instant death, by the way. Because it could very well be. I know it's good enough. No! 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 I didn't know where to go! Woo! Okay. Alright! Okay. So, the thing with fighting a new boss you've never seen at the end of a boss rush, if you die, you have to do the whole arena again. So, yeah, it's kind of, it, it's up for debate whether I want to try and do it, and I'm also doing a buster only, remember, so it doesn't make me feel that bad if I do indeed use an E-Tank in it. We get a Terra out, because we passed it, so that was the Mausoleum Arena. We've got one more left in here. And then there is also the one arena from Mag Mammal 2. That one I might be able to beat without any E-Tanks because I recognize all the bosses there. But that's it for this arena. That second boss was 
Awesome! I've never fought Terra either, so any of the bosses from Mega Man on the Game Boy, they're all new. Uranus pretty much instantly killed me with his squashing attack, which I'm going to show you after this. Mercury was relatively fine. Pluto I've never fought. Saturn I got exposure to before. And Terra, Terra's Spark Chaser, really chases you down. And the different kind of implementations of it here were very nice to see. Anyway, that's it for this video. We've done two of the arenas. Next time we'll do the one over there. Um, but for now, thank you very much for watching, and I will see you in the next video. Till then, take care. Or have a CD outtake, and then I'll see you in the next video. That's it. Oh, wow. Now, Uranus I haven't actually fought in the contest, so... This one's gonna be blind. I don't think I've ever fought you, actually. Okay, okay, yes. Oh, I need time to bite! And that, ladies and gentlemen, is why not having fought a boss previously can be quite fatal. Wow! An instant death attack that I just had no idea. Okay! Yeah, that's honestly... Because I haven't fought Uranus anywhere in the contest yet. I don't think I've ever fought Uranus, period. Yeah, that was a thing. Well, we have an outtake, but that's unironically hilarious. I wasn't expecting to lose in the arena, to be perfectly fair. But when you get a gotcha trap moment like that, there's not really much I could have done, I just, I saw it coming down a bit, but it was too late. Wow, that's how to end one run, well, yeah, that's fun, I guess I'll show that at the end of the actual successful attempt, so yeah, at least you have an outtake to enjoy, because that was funny.